everyone, Lori Marie here, Mixed Media Artist in Vallejo, California. Oh, it's a chilly day out there. The sun is gorgeous, but it is chilly. I uh, did a little transfer on um, ledger pa paper and uh, sewing pattern paper, and then the transfer on top of that. The transfer was a bit dark, so a lot of the... it came out snowy anyway and to touch it it was smooth so it was there was no more paper to remove uh, it was a magazine image um, Nancy had sent me a card it's around here someplace it's absolutely divine anyway Nancy had sent me a card where she had done a magazine transfer image transfer on a sewing pattern and it turned out great mine was very snowy so uh, mixed media art well all art is um, constantly finding a solution. <laughs> when something doesn't go quite the way you think it's going to go, you find a solution. So I put crackle, uh, one step crackle on it, and it turned out gorgeous. So I actually sent it as a little thank you note to Susan, who gave me, she sent me a gorgeous uh, book of uh, stamps to use in mixed media, which I'm so excited about. And uh, thank you, Maria, for ordering a book. And thank you, Bonnie, for your uh, contribution to the village. Thank you so much. Try to stay on top of those thank you notes. Let's see, what else do I need to say? Oh, um, if you're part of the Underpants Club, there is always a giveaway, a raffle the first of the month. And Claire Hampton uh, is the winner, and I heard from her yesterday. So, uh, mailing her goodie out today. She's actually getting one of our t-shirts. That's our underpants giveaway for October. So, if you're part of the underpants club, you will, your name will go in uh, the first of the month, and I'll pick a name and send something fun to you. So, sometimes it'll be a magnet or a book or a piece of artwork or something like that. So, uh, just fun, fun stuff. So, anyway, Claire, thank you, a.k.a. Susan. Um, Thank you for playing along in the Underpants Club. Your package is on its way. All right, I think that's it. I don't feel like there's much more to say. Oh, there's always more to say, but uh, I think I'm going to stop there. All right, see you on the table. Okay, good evening. It is boys' night out, and I'm spending some time on my table. All right, I have an old piece of ledger paper from 1945. It is an original. Gotta love that. And I have a piece of pattern paper, and I'm going to glue that onto here with Mod Podge. There'll be some wrinkles on here. That's just part of the charm of the sewing pattern. Now I am going to take, this has got some nice Mod Podge on it, not dry yet, of course. I'm going to take this image. This is an image from a magazine. I'm going to put Mod Podge on there. it and put it on my page somewhat straight would be nice not bad bring in a credit card
and I will let that dry overnight. See you in the morning. Um, I did peel all the layer, the outer layer of this off. Um, it's quite snowy. I'm not sure we can fix that or not. Uh, we shall see. Uh, I'm bringing in my one-step crackle. And I'm going to paint it onto the image, the transfer, and see what happens. The thicker you put this on, the bigger the cracks. I'll set this aside someplace flat. <laughs> Such a good idea. We'll check back in on it later. I'm with Preston and Parker today, so it's easy to let this dry and not fiddle with it because I won't be home. Wowza, look at this. I'm going to hold it close so you can see some of the cracks. This is just gorgeous. Next time I would use a lighter image. Um, more contrast probably. But I'm very happy with this. So your turn. Go create. Go play. Go have fun.